in meditation you experience who you really are and when you experience who you really are you experience god and when you experience god you realize that who you are and what you know as god is the same that god is within you and that you that you're experiencing is god that is why i say life is not happening to you life is happening through you anger hate jealousy they're supposed to be that's why they exist god has made that that's why they exist and that's why you're experiencing it nothing wrong in that absolutely nothing wrong in that so do not feel guilty about anything you have to learn to leave yourself alone to experience the true self this union of you knowing yourself and knowing that god is you this union is what is spiritual practice is the end result of spiritual practice that's it that is why you are where you are you are seeing what you're seeing you're experiencing what you're seeing because god wants to live through you when you are being yourself you are being god you are being one with the universe the union happens when the union happens you become god when you are yourself whatever you see the god meant god wants to see god is seeing through you he's living through you he is experiencing this earthly life through you how can he be present on earth the earth that he is created he is there in present uh, in trees in animals in the animals living in the ocean in the birds it's all god and in a human form in a more intellectual form in a more evolved form he's living through the humans you are the uh, the, the latest version and the best version of of human and mankind you're the latest version because you're living in the now so be yourself and then god is experiencing this earth this human life god is experiencing through you how else can he experience this life on earth how else if you're living in the opposition of who you really are then you're causing friction for yourself and you're living in insanity and if you're living with your true self the way you are you'll realize every challenge that you have gone through was meant to be nothing was there but was not meant to be the way you look at the challenge now which will change challenge will not be challenge anymore you will understand that there for a reason you will find bliss in that all the challenges that you have faced you will 
you will learn to see them as a blessing rather than challenges. All the challenges that you have faced were a reason why it would have been an it would have been a, a doorway that would have opened for other people to come in. Or you to vision or to see something that was beyond your, your understanding or that you have not experienced before. So every part of you is serving a purpose. Even if you don't understand the purpose, for sure that purpose might be beyond your understanding. But that does not mean that any part of that is right or wrong.